There is still hope tonight for Southern California's 99 cent only store. An effort is now underway to keep some of them from shutting down permanently. NBC4's Amber Frias spoke with a local investor leading the charge. The 99-cent store. Customers rush into a 99-cents-only store in Pico Rivera as they prepare for the chain's closure. Everyone is going to feel not having the store open anymore. For many, the store has been a lifeline, offering affordable prices that stretch tight budgets. The fabric software now pay $20 for a huge thing, and here I'm paying $5 for it. The chain is set to close all 371 locations nationwide, but there's a glimmer of hope for 143 Southern California stores. I said, okay. Okay, let me see if I could put together a group of people to buy this this chain. Mark Miller, CEO of Pick and Save Bargains and former president of Big Lots, is hoping to save the beloved bargain store. He's put together a team of investors who want to continue the chain's commitment to the community. It's going to still be oriented on food, consumables, uh, general merchandise, seasonal. His plan is to save the stores by going back to the basics. It was a treasure hunt. It was you never knew what you were going to find. Never, never, never. And you said, I'm going to go there because I never know what I'm going to find. And I can also find some good basic stuff. Miller says bargain stores have struggled due to them trying to compete with traditional stores rather than embracing their unique appeal. That customer wants to be surprised. If I said you, if you walk into a number of stores, sometimes you can close your eyes and you're in the same store. I want customers to be able to come and go, wow, this place is different. Back at the discount store, the news of a potential intervention of investors is bringing a sense of optimism to the community. And if they're able to save it, they're saving a lot of people's pockets a lot of money. Hopefully it can be rescued. As customers cling on to the hope that their beloved 99 cents only store will stay open. Amber Frias, NBC4 News.